COVID going on. Um, and you're talking about the patients coming in, seeing the patients. At Premier Pharmacy, what are you guys doing to protect yourself and protect the patients um, during this COVID? And are you offering free delivery so that the patients don't have to come in? Mm -hmm. So one of the things was we've always offered free delivery, even before COVID. And that's one of the things I love about being um, a smaller entity is because you're able to see things and to be more human than like a lot of these um, other stores or companies are. So we've always understood that um, transportation was a huge barrier for individuals, especially the elderly population, especially for the population that uses mo um, medication the most. Um, which are usually, you know, the elderly population and unfortunately um, communities that are maybe low income um, due to a lot of times low income and the lack of education, those usually um, correlate with each other. And so that's why those individuals need pharmacists the most, pharmacists that can actually educate them and, tr and teach them like how to you know, use medications the right way, what to expect from medications and different things like that. That's why it's so important that we actually are in those communities. Um, so when COVID came about, we had already had um, free delivery available to our patients, being able to deliver it right to their doorstep in addition to like PPE. So it wasn't just that, you know, we were delivering medications, but we also deliver, um, you know, um, PPE, we were delivering our, to our elderly population, they were requesting bread and you know, like fruit and different things like that to the point where we, ne we don't carry those items, but we went out and we, um, through our foundation, got these bags together that, you know, um, we're able to deliver to our senior population so they didn't have to go out and come back, you know, um, COVID on public transportation or in Walmart and different things like that. So um, we also work with our um, software companies. They did a great job at giving us additional services um, that they had been working on but had not yet released, such as um, contactless payment where we sent the patients these links via their cell phone uh, or their email and they were able to pay that way versus having to come into the store. We did um, parking lot pickup or curbside pickup where patients will pull up to one of our designated areas, um, call us and we would, go out to the car in our PPE to make sure that we could actually, um, you know, deliver the services right to their door um, or right to their car and they didn't have to really interact or come into the store. Um, we reduced the number of people that could actually be in the store and for our provider visits that were or could be virtual, we made those visits virtual and even um, on the pharmacy side, we we're able to counsel our patients while they were virtual as well. 